I'm just an angry old man. I'm aiming straight for your head. Ain't got no reason speaking to you if we ain't breaking no bread. I got demons, I got I'm trying to erase all my blessings. Dealing with PSTD, anxiety, and depression. Permanently, I'm damaged. Back when we met, I was panicked. Niggas call me lacking, one too busy chasing. Electric coupling module. You said it was nothing serious when I came in. You said you were sure. Guess I was wrong. Can always look for another shop where they won't ask a lone nomad why he's hugging the border. You're wearing on my patience now. I'm gonna pay you what we agreed, not one anymore. Huh. For that, you can borrow my tools and fix it yourself. That's fine. Step aside. What? Got any idea what to do? <clears throat> I'm gonna bypass the coupling and rig a hot wire. Compressor will run on and on. It could seize up. Did anyone ask your opinion? Okay, let's see what happens. It's like I was telling you. No. Not shabby at all. Questions how long it'll last you. Yeah, it'll get me to Night City. I figure something else out there. Right. Mm -hmm. Antenna on this heap don't seem like it packs a punch. 
Not liable to him much. You don't say. Hey, Mike. Didn't know you had a customer. Uh, rolled in a few hours past. I, I, I thought uh, he'd at least called in to Don't you. you swear to Mike. We're gonna hash it out. Don't you know you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. No need to worry. I won't be staying long. Didn't answer my question now, did you? Name's Andrew Jones. Probably heard of me. New episode? I can't say that I have. Served in spec ops during the last war. Silver showguns? Ring any bells? I can't say that it does. Don't like to get along, do ya? That a nomad vehicle? Might have expected that. I'll just fix it and go. I've no reason to linger. <sighs> nope. You sure shit don't. Nothing boils my blood like a fucking stray. Where'd your clan pitch camp? There is no clan. There is no camp. I'm here alone. Ain't buying it. Nomads always stick to their packs. My family's in pieces. That's why I'm headed for Night City. Makes you an outcast among outcasts. Sure as hell hope you'll be on your way before long. I saw broadcast in comms tower on my way in. My antenna's down, and I need to radio someone. What you need's to hightail it out of here without another word. Ain't got no mind to see you drifting around these parts. Got it? I made it clear. I don't want any trouble. Then stop looking for it and hit the road quick. Come in. Ah, raised you finally. Willie McCoy, it's good to hear your voice. Fee, wish I could say the same. 
I need your help. One last time. One last time. Again? I have to find a client with my payload, but I don't know where he is. Hmm. Right place, right time. You were there? Of course I was. Maybe the client left a message. Could you check for me? Hmm. Sure. Last time, though. I mean it. Client's name? Jackie Wells. Huh. Actually left a message. He's waiting on a farm. Flicking you the geolog data. Thanks, Willie. I owe you one. You do. Just don't get yourself killed. And don't call again. I was worried I'd have to turn to farming. <laughs> yeah, sure hope you're here for me. I believe I am. Are you... Name's Jackie Wells. V. Seems you have cargo that needs to be moved. 
Oh, where I'm from, you share a bit about your soul before you talk biz, eh? It's kind of like a custom. Or just good manners, you know? Why don't we start with you, then? NC native, right here. Got Haywood in my blood. I've never been to NC. That doesn't mean much to me. So, imagine a place where everyone's like your bro or sis. Or a <laughs> distant cousin, at least. <laughs> I think I understand. You don't have to like each other, but it's family. That's Haywood. That and everyone's back in iron. And you? I guess one could say I'm from my own Haywood. You and me, we're gonna get along fine. The cargo. Gonna be long? What's inside? You sleep better the less you know. Got no idea myself, and that's a good thing. You don't know what we aim to smuggle? These are stolen corporate goods. Stolen? No. Oh. Some gonk lost the crate. Some other gonk found it, passed it on. Now it's here. You know, butterfly effect or whatever. And there's no one looking for this crate? Ain't a problem if they look. Only a problem if they find it before it crosses the border, no? Hello? Let's load it in the car. A huevo. Started thinking you might not come. I got held up. And you weren't exactly easy to find. I decided to lay low, you know? The sheriff looked like one grouchy motherfucker. Yep. So, we headed out? you have the manifest from the transport? Of course I do. But the Fixer didn't give you the job deeds? He... he did. I was just making sure. Listen, friend. We're both professionals, ain't we? Hey, you, uh, sure you've moved contraband before? Why, are you nervous? Me? <laughs> ah, por favor. Well, uh, maybe a little. God damn it. Well, uh, maybe a little. Hey, water crossing up ahead. What now? Nothing. They'll scan us and check our papers. <sighs> okay. I'll do the talking. Please direct your vehicle to the inspection area. Remain in your vehicle. The security check will begin shortly. I got a real bad feeling about this. Hand me the manifest. Don't need to see it. Grab these. Let me see. <laughs> it's marked LOA. Perfect. What's that mean? Lost on arrival. It means the cargo is flagged as to be lost as soon as it crossed the border. Oh. So they know we're smuggling. They're about to find out. 
The owner of the vehicle in the inspection area will report for further questioning. Ah, chingada madre. What now? If we want the customs officer to turn a blind eye to our dubious docus, we'll need a sweetener. Do you have the credit chip with the bribe? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Forgot about that. Right. You forgot. I'll keep the engine running, in case of a cock-up. Do that. If you're armed, place your weapon here. Now please report to room number two. Room two. It's important, important that you go. 70% real blood dripping meat. Slaughterhouse, satisfy your instincts. Please sit. Papers. Papers. Hand them over. I know the rules. Everything's there. It might be. It might not be. We'll see. Hmm. What are you transporting? It's all in there. Everything? There's one additional enclosure to the manifest. Ah, yes. Remind me, you drive for which Nomad Clan? Look, let's just make this quick, okay? None. No clan. I drive for myself. Bold. And none too wise. You know, whenever I see someone like you, I'm oh so grateful not to be on that side of the table. The feeling's mutual. Go on now. Your associate's waiting for you in the car. Don't forget to take your personal items. Be careful with that toy, and welcome to Night City. Those little shits imagine Night City is some kind of paradise. What can you do? Young, naive, which is just a euphemism for ignorant. What happened in there? You are now leaving Night City. Please be reminded that the Badlands is not under NCPD jurisdiction. I'll tell you soon. We need to get out of here. Yeah, okay. You gonna tell me what happened back there? The customs dickhead got nitpicky. And that ain't normal? Not to that extent. Smelling trouble around the bend? Drive, Jackie, just drive. Someone's coming our way. This does not look good. Immediately. Let's get out of here. On it. You are transporting contraband that is corporate property. I repeat, stop the car. Damn.
Mongols are stubborn! V! Watch it! Mierda. Close call. We lost them. Hey, Sluz. Not sure my nerves can handle this. Keep driving. We can't stop here. Place looks deserted. Gonna stop here. Need to sort out a few things before we go on. Fucking hell. They almost tagged our asses. That what you call smuggling? Chingado! Was supposed to go smooth. No problems. Calm down. Sometimes these things happen. This? What kind of shit happens? Border security tipped off the corporation that we have their cargo. What's the deal with these borderlies flipping us the finger as they fucking please? With no consequences. He took a risk. He assumed we didn't have a clan backing us. And he was right. <sighs> so what now? Hello? I could ask the same question. Will you keep whining, or will we put a bow on this thing? Uh, I ain't gonna lie. I'm a bit light. Can't pay you now. I have something for you once I collect my scrap for this corpo crap we're carrying. Huh. And you just figured I would sit by patiently. Actually, I wasn't gonna pay you at all. I'm just gonna bust ass and disappear as soon as we crossed over. But you're all right. I appreciate the honesty. Yeah, thanks. So, what's next? Now we take a peek inside. Open it. Aw, oh, shit. It says Arasaka on the crate. We are robbing some heavy hitters. And maybe we'll make some heavy money. Oh, mames. A real iguana. A, uh, lesser Antillian, I think. You think you can make some money on it? Sure. Think it'll make us happy. Us. Yeah, partner. We'll go half seas. Any decent fixer will find a loaded gonk interested in a rare gem like this. It's kind of a shame, though. I always wanted a pet. Got the name Manny all thought out. Hey, by the way, you, uh, got any plans for what you'll be doing in Night City? Why do you ask? Because I got this feeling you got a lot of time and nothing to spend it on. And NC ain't a city that lets you get by without buddies. But don't you worry. Let me help you find Diggs. You gotta live somewhere. It's important to have people you can turn to. You know, like uh, family. Maybe you'll find your own down in Night City. Thanks. Much appreciated. Hey, come on. It's nothing. We got chemistry, you and me. Be a crying shame to waste it. Partner. Hey! Aw, cuddly little fucker. Okay, partner. Time to grab the lizard and scurry out of here. in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps 
of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals, but only half these gongs will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Black Hand, and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the bigger the party kids. Or so they say. But you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. If you don't get a bullet to the brain first. These legends know where you'll find most of them. The graveyard. <laughs> matters not where you're from. Matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City. The city of dreams.